I uh, just finished up a, a long day in clinic and wanted to share a thought that I had today when I was seeing my patients. And I think this is really important. And that is this, I had a lot of patients today come in that were very metabolically ill. Now, these patients were in their 40s, 50s, and 60s. They had everything from cardiac disease to hypertension, to diabetes, to morbid obesity, skin condition, edema, all types of other uh, chronic uh, conditions. And today's clinic was especially challenging because so many of the patients had so many comorbidities and illnesses and were trying to sort through them and make a decision on who uh, is a surgical candidate and who really needs to uh, be more metabolically optimized before undergoing uh, larger procedures. And the one thought that was recurring in my head today was, what was this person like 20 years ago? What if we could go back in time and speak to their 20 year old younger self and tell them where they would be in 20 years? Would their decisions have been the same? Would their lifestyle choices have been the same? Would they have made the effort to make nutritional changes, have controlled uh, their stress levels, have sought different types of care and therapies and biohacks and alternative treatments? Or would they have run the same course and I think if any of us are shown a video of ourselves 20 years in the future and saw what I saw today in my clinic, that might worry us and scare us enough that we would make instant, instant lifestyle changes and manage our health so much differently. This really speaks to how poorly we are doing with wellness and preventative services in our country, because I see this day in and day out. And I think these questions need to be asked. What does the future hold for us 20 years from now? What are our choices now going to do to our bodies 20 years from now? Let's all ask ourselves these questions. Let's ask ourselves, how can we make these important changes? And I think the world will be a far healthier and happier place. On that note, that's my rant for the day. I hope you guys are having a great day. I'll see you on the next video. Until then, have a wonderful day.